Two brand new modes make their debut in MLB The Show 16, the first being Battle Royale. In Battle Royale, you compete versus other players in the Diamond Dynasty mode after drafting a team of your own choice. Win, and you have a chance at some awesome rewards. At the beginning of Battle Royale, you will use 1500 stubs to enter. The first time is free, after that is 1500 stubs each. Win or lose, you will be rewarded with the standard pack so you do get something out of it regardless. After you draft your team, you play head to head versus an opponent in a three inning contest. And he's drafted his team as well. So head to head, you guys go head up with the chance to win some cool rewards. As you continue to win, you win more rewards up the way like flashback Alex Rodriguez, legends like Luis Tia and Nolan Ryan, which you can only win in Battle Royale. Conquest. The second of the new modes they added to MLB The Show 16, Conquest is an online single player mode where you take your Diamond Dynasty team up versus 30 MLB CPU teams. Like a turn based strategy game, you compete with other teams for fans, which are the primary resource in Conquest. You need to build up this fan base to be successful. Fans will allow you to conquer and protect territories as well as directly affect which difficulties you can play on. Each turn will dictate strategic moves you can make like attack, capture, and move. Conquest Strongholds Strongholds are key territories where you reinforce your fans. As mentioned previously, this dictates what level of difficulty you're able to play on. Conquest games are three innings, just like Battle Royale. I hope you guys enjoy all the new features and improvements this year in the show. We'll continue to have tips and strategies posted frequently to keep you guys at the top of your game as the season progresses. So be sure to like, subscribe, and stay tuned for more MLB The Show 16 here at Sports Gamers Online. This is The Natural. I'm out. Juan Marichal. So right now we're going to get pitches away. By the way, I'm using the extended offset. So how, I don't know if you guys are familiar or not with how um, pure analog hitting used to work, but to start your stride, you simply hold down on the right stick about the time you see him cock the ball back. So right about now, all right, and then you flick the stick forward in the direction in which the ball is crossing the plate. All right, so it means if the ball was away there,